Hello, and welcome to the Gary Stewart Show, presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Greg Royce, joined once again by Stevenson Head Men's Basketball Coach Gary Stewart. Coach, a couple Mac games, on, Mac Commonwealth games on the road this past weekend. Let's start on Wednesday night at Messiah. Um, you know, very defensive battle, um, but at the end, you know, Messiah was able to make, make a couple more plays and uh, pull out the victory. Uh, can I take us to that one a little bit and um, your team's effort? We executed uh, defensively really well. Uh, not only the game band, but our energy was great. Um, we uh, had multiple efforts um, during a possession, uh, but to credit M Messiah, uh, as you um, as you put it uh, so appropriately, Greg, they uh, made plays down the stretch, and uh, we weren't able to get um, a stop when we needed. And offensively, I thought we had some good looks all night, but uh, but we came up short. Yeah, they just they just didn't see want to want to go down, kind of similar to the last the previous game against um, Arcadia. It's, a couple of looks, you know, got good looks, just didn't go down for you guys. And obviously, when you're not shooting well, it's tough to tough to win basketball games. It is, yeah. Um, and then Saturday, um, you go to Winder, another road game. Winder's been playing really well. They just beat Lycoming. Um, you know, and you hung with them for stretches again, but you know, unfortunately, you know, just the uh, final result wasn't there. But I think the final score also a little bit deceiving. Well, I didn't think we played particularly well in any area. Uh, we had individuals that, that played uh, very well, uh, Keith Moody, yeah. um, Cameron Harris, um, two guys that had come to mind that had good outings. Um, but uh, uh, we just never had a, a flow um, yeah. offensively. And, and uh, defensively, uh, we, we felt uh, pretty good, although they had 38 points at, at halftime. We felt pretty good about – um, limiting their threes and yep. um, the second part of the first half we got back in transition um, and we out rebounded them in the first half so there were some pluses there second half um, got completely away from um, what we were trying to do um, and uh, uh, we, we just didn't uh, uh, stayed disciplined. Yeah. We we uh, the ball stuck offensively. We took some really really tough shots. Some of those shots led out um, led to some runouts on the other yeah. end. Um, it, it, all in all, I thought it was the worst half of basketball we played all year. Yeah, and so obviously the transition numbers. I think they had like twenty something fast break points. I'm sure a lot of that was transition off of you know maybe poor shot selection things like that. Yeah, uh, typically when you see a, a number like that, you go immediately to the turnovers. But but we took a, a lot of really tough shots, ill advised shots, early shots that were contested in the in the um, shot clock. Um, now all in all, I, I just felt like we. Um, uh, we, we lost uh, concentration in the second half, and, and uh, Widener capitalized on that. Yeah. They're, they're playing very good uh, basketball, and, and uh, you can ill afford to do that against anybody in our conference. Yeah, absolutely. All right. Um, now you're back home for two games this week, um, starting with Hood on Wednesday night. Um, what's going to be the message to the team when they come in for practice today and you show them some of the film from Saturday? Well, I, I think they're keenly aware of the areas that we need to improve on, and, and um, we're going to show them some things that we did really, really well, and we're going to show them some things that uh, we've got to get better in a hurry um, at. And uh, it's no secret that uh, when, when the ball moves, we're, we're better offensively. When it yeah. sticks and we don't have either man movement or ball movement, uh, that um, is to our detriment. Yeah, it's obviously tough to, um, if you got one guy with the ball and four guys standing around, it's tough to uh, get good shots out of, out of that. It is. And then uh, conversely, um, we we played, uh, I thought, very well um, defensively against Messiah, and, and then give up way too many points against uh, Widener. So we've got to we got to get back to grinding it out on both ends of the floor, um, and uh, that will be the message. All right, well, coach, thanks a lot for your time, and we'll see you right here at Owens Mills Gymnasium for two games this week. Thank you, Greg. For Gary Stewart, I'm Greg Royce. This has been the Gary Stewart Show.